Hey, how's it going everybody? It's Ocean back with another Destiny 2 Daily Legend Lost Sector video and we are going back to the EDZ to do a very good Lost Sector in Sky Dock 4. Champions are going to be Barrier and Unstoppable, the burn is Solar, Shields are going to be Void, Modifier, Pestilence, and we are going for some Exotic Leg Armor today. Alright guys, let's take a look at the weapons that we are going to be using. This time around it's a... This is a little weird. I'm not too sure the best setup for primary weapon. For those of you that do not have the Galahorn, you're definitely going to want to use a anti-barrier weapon. Scout rifle, auto rifle, it's up to you in the first primary slot what you want to use. I am able to one-shot the barrier champions with the Galahorn before his shield comes up. Uh, I can even take him out quickly with a shotgun if I need to because I have one two punch and liar's handshake is a uh, you know increased damage and all that and just the the lethal current also increases melee damage because it has that arc damaging uh, aftershock anyway it's up to you guys if you want to do a shotgun for increased damage up close and personal or if you guys want to use a anti-barrier weapon I would suggest just any primary scout rifle or auto rifle because in your secondary spot you're going to want to have a void weapon and there is the yesteryear which is a gambit pulse rifle that you can get from the season in gambit a void a void pulse rifle void also sorry not void pulse rifles are unstoppable this season so there are three unstoppable champions in this lost sector and one barrier champion so that's why i'm using a shotgun just to do extra damage to the boss because I am using my arc class because it's arc 3.0 and I do not want to switch over just yet or void I want to keep playing on arc I do suggest if you guys are trying to do this quicker maybe hop on a solar class but I'm just gonna play with my arc strider subclass and use gathering storm because I am having fun doing it bad amplitude is a good arc modifier to damaging a champion with an arc ability causes the champion to become jolted Make sure if you are using a auto rifle or a scout rifle, you have that mod on accordingly, and then your unstoppable mod as well. I'm using double hands on to make sure I can get my super by the time we are ready to fight the boss because we can still get through this lost sector very quickly. All right, hunters, let's take a look at this real quick. I know I've talked a lot this time around. Gambler's Dodge, Triple Jump, Combination Blow, Storm Grenade, Flow State. Lethal current for my aspects. Fragments are going to be Spark of Magnitude, Volts, Beacons, and Resistance. And there you guys have it. Let's hop into this Lost Sector and see how it's done. Alright, there we go guys, a minute and 37 seconds. I do suggest using your solar subclass, but a minute 37 seconds on an arc subclass is pretty good. You guys could probably lower that down to about a minute 15, even under a minute if you do it super quick. But thank you guys all so much for watching today's video. I will catch you guys all later on the next one and have a great rest of your day.